All right, guys, so today's video is going to be about me polishing the frame on a CRF 250R. So before I polished it, I washed or sprayed the bike off and wiped it down and sprayed some tire shine on it and made sure it was nice and clean. Tire shine, it's good to slip, it gets the surface good and slippery, so mud and dirt will just slide right off and everything. I recommend it if you just need something to like shine up your bike and gives it a little shiny too. So It also shines up black rims really well. Now we begin the tear down of the bike. So to tear down the bike, you want to take um, the two side panels off, the radiator shrouds, actually. You want to take those off. And then after that, you want to take the seat off. And then when you take the seat off, you take the other pieces off, the back fender, the side panels, and then the gas tank. Most bikes, the gas tank, or the little fuel on and off thing, is on the gas tank this one is not so you might spill some gas everywhere but the muffler didn't come off either so to take the subframe off well i haven't got there yet but take the subframe off it should most bikes both the bikes i've polished it's just one big bolt on the top and then two bolts on the side it's really nothing it's not hard to take off at all and plus anybody can do this at home All right, guys, so I got this thing torn down, got the subframe off. Couldn't get the muffler off. I'm just going to leave it on there. It ain't hurt nothing. But got it fully tore down. Um, I'm going to dry it off real quick, um, clean it up. Got some stuff right here, all this. Really nothing to take off. I mean, the subframe is ain't but three bolts and one little bolt right here for the air box. It's nothing. But I'm going to clean it up, wipe it off and everything, and then I'm going to start polishing. So stay tuned for that. All right, so I got most of the frame right here cleaned up, guys. It was kind of dusty and all right through here. I'm gonna polish the frame right here first because I had to spray off the dang subframe. This thing is kind of dirty. Yeah, it's still dirty too. I'm gonna let it sit out in the sun, maybe dry it off a little bit. Um, hopefully the polish will get some of it out. But right now, it's gonna go to a time lapse here in just a second, but I'm gonna start polishing the frame, so stay tuned for that. Okay, so to polish the frame, you wanna get a microfiber towel, get some polish onto the towel. You wanna just rub it in real good on the frame. Now, this is only for aluminum frames. You get it on there, and as soon as you get a black film over the surface you are polishing, you start to go to a cleaner part of the towel and you just start rubbing that stuff in. It'll get it out really good. It, trust me, all this stuff works. All right, guys, so got that side nice and shiny. I'll wipe it down real quick, make sure I really did get it. Okay, looks better than it did, I'll tell you that. It's real slippery too, look at this. Nice and slippery, look at that. That is beautiful. Not as beautiful as the 125s right now. That one's shiny. Shine up the inside too. You may wonder, why'd you shine up, shine up the inside? No one's going to see it. Well, I, I will. I know it's there. Yeah, this stuff is slippery. Look how slippery that is. I'm barely moving my hand. Oh, man, look at that. All right. I got this side all nice and shiny. I'm going to head over to the other side in just a second, so stay tuned. Yeah, it's shining up real good. Obviously, this side, same thing. Just get a little stuff on the towel, rub it in until there's a black film. And when the black film's on there, you just get to a cleaner part of the towel and just rub that stuff in. It's perfectly good. I don't remember the exact price of these little things, but trust me, this is only, the only second one I bought, and we bought two when we first did it. So now I think they're about 10 bucks for a, buck, a little thing, but trust me, it will be worth it in the end if you want a cheap way to make your frame have a way better appearance. It will work, trust me.
The frame is looking awesome. Look how shiny this came out. It might not be as shiny as the 125's frame, which is like a mirror, but it's pretty decent for just a little tub of aluminum polish. So. It's doing pretty good. I think I'm gonna take the um, brake lever off and polish it up. Is it, it's looking a little dull. Um, something's wrong with the kick, Kickstarter here. Yeah, I don't think that's supposed to do that. Yeah. I'm gonna have to fix that. I think, oh, I think I got something over here. It might work. What's this? Got a bolt. Nope. Nope. That didn't work. Alright. Um. I'm going to take the shifter off, polish it up, and this will be the end of this video, guys. Part two will be me polishing the subframe right there. Part two will be me polishing that. So, subscribe, like, comment, share. Check out Jake or Two Stroke Jake 7 Change his name. He's at, he just recently got to 100 subscribers, so we need to get 200 before he can. So, subscribe, guys. I'll catch you on the next one. Take care. Peace out.